Hi everyone, welcome back. Today I'm going to show you how to set up a simple two-step automation using Automation Studio in Marketing Cloud. To keep this quick, we're going to work under the assumption that you've already got some automation activities built out. Here's where we show how to put them together, how to actually schedule or fire your automation um, on a regular schedule, and how to activate it and look out for error notifications. Once you've logged into Marketing Cloud, first thing you want to do is navigate to Automation Studio, which hides under Journey Builder. In Automation Studio, in the Overview section, you can click New Automation, name your automation, and uh, decide your starting source. Mine is not going to be a file drop or triggered automation. Instead, I want this to run on a daily schedule. So I'm going to choose schedule. We'll configure the details at the end. On the Canvas activity, uh, I know I want to refresh my audience every day before that email sends. So I've got a SQL query that's joining together two tables that get updated pretty regularly. Um, I want the SQL query to process the data before that email sends each day. So I'm going to choose my inner join SQL. I can just check that everything looks good by verifying my code down there. Click done. And then I'm going to add my email send activity step. I've already configured this, but if I hadn't, you could do so just by clicking on create new send email activity. So I'm selecting my welcome email. And again, I can preview all my details down here just to make sure everything looks okay, and then click Done. I'm going to click Save, and now I'm going to configure my schedule. I want this to start sending tomorrow, and I want this to send every day. At noon Eastern. So choose the time zone you want. We'll do Atlantic. Um, you can choose the, for this to run um, hourly, daily, weekly, monthly, whatever you need. And I'm going to have this stop after um, 14 occurrences. So it's going to run for two weeks only. Now, before I automate this, I'm going to specify an email address so that any error notifications get sent to me uh, in case this automation fails for whatever reason. Again, I'll click Save. You could run this once to test everything works well um, prior to activating your automation. Then return to Workflow and click on Activate when you are ready to go. Thanks, everybody, and please remember to subscribe to my channel.